All right, so it says that we have the newest version. Go ahead and verify that on here. Okay. Go ahead and disconnect from this. And we'll go ahead <clears throat> disconnect, reconnect. Another lights, particularly that Bluetooth light, always lit up when it beeped. Okay, let's go firmware fix. This scan is for Bluetooth devices. You can find it. Your settings. Find Bluetooth. Yeah. Well, please focus. <laughs> and as you can see, it's not showing anything there. Scan. speaker as you see nothing else is coming oh, there's that thing Continuously scan, but this is coming up. Um, let me check phone real quick. I have no Bluetooth devices, I just can't screenshot it onto here. Um, here's a test on the Wi Fi like, connection part of the Smart Box 3, and it passed. Go ahead and open this back up. We are connected. And as you see right there, we have a computer connection. And we'll go to here, open this back up. Because this itself has a firmware fix. Okay. And this should be the same thing of a firmware fix from the tablet. Repair is complete. Go ahead. And Shut down all that stuff. Go back here. I even disconnect this guy. So, let's see, still scanning here. Not finding anything. 
and I will check again on my phone. And still not finding anything. Um, I'll take a screenshot and send that. But this is where I'm at. That this this won't connect any other way but through Bluetooth. Like when I go into here, like that does the same thing that the Smartbox 3 tool does. Um, but this tablet will not connect to the Smartbox using a USB. It will only connect through Bluetooth. I can't even connect through Wi-Fi on this. That's only for PCs to pass through. Um, so as far as it looks, the Bluetooth is dead, but the logic components and the Wi-Fi component still seems to be active. So if we can warranty out this or like send it in for repair, please, pretty please.